Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, is everything running, everything good, everything's okay. Oh, it looks like everything's good. Okay, okay, hello, 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 hello everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome back to all my followers, welcome to all the newcomers. We are here, and we're playing some more stasis. Uh, yeah, so far, uh... We're gonna probably be reading a lot of PDAs if we ever come across them, so it's, it's the same old usual thing with this game. But it, it is definitely scary. I feel like it's more eerie in, in, in a sense, like atmospheric wise, it's pretty eerie. But um, I'm not I'm not gonna sit here and say there wasn't any scares, but there's, so, there's been a few scares so far, which I'm happy to say actually got me uh, quite a few times. But anyways, hello everybody. Before we start, I wanna let everyone know that this stream's gonna be available as a VOD, once I have to stop on, so you can check it out here on twitch.tv slash weirdo immediately. Or, if you're watching the VODs on YouTube, youtube.com slash TV. Check them out there. And subscribe to the channel if you can't make it, but if you can make it, I stream almost every day here on twitch.tv slash weirdo around 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, U.S. West Coast. That's when I usually stream. Uh, so, for those of you who are missing out or don't want to miss out, yo. You stop watching Kitchen Nightmares for this? What's up, River? <laughs> hey, Craft, how are you? How's everybody? Oh, how's everybody? Almost every day, unless he gets drunk instead. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. Unfortunately, that's very true. <laughs> well, I mean, I don't get drunk always. Like, even previously to that, I didn't even drink that much. I drink like maybe once or twice a year. So it's not going to be all the time, you know. You make me sound like an alcoholic, though. Shame. <laughs> I was watching Kitchen Nightmares while drawing some KOCs of mine. Nice. That's what you want. You want to hear Gordon Ramsay while you try <laughs> some KOCs. If you did it, if you did at some point, we get a drunk stream, which would be fun. I don't know, dude. <laughs> I get I get a little bit too mouthy when I'm drunk. To be honest, I get I get way too mouthy. I just start talking mad shit. <laughs> but anyways, I uploaded yesterday's vod today. Uh, yeah, so it's up on my YouTube channel now. This vibe will be up tomorrow on my YouTube channel. And, uh, well, I mean, that's, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, I made sure that I put Tibbs' Twitter and his SoundCloud. Check him out. He's the one who has gifted me this game. I'm going to keep putting it up in, uh, in the, in the, in the description on my YouTube videos. So check it out. Follow him on Twitter, follow the SoundCloud, listen to the SoundCloud if you like what you hear, give him a follow. So yeah. As, as, as opposed to your usual non-mouthy self. Listen, listen, buddy. I get more rowdy actually. I get more rowdy actually is the real way to say it. So anyways. Uh... Oh, craft. I watched I watched uh I watched Transfers 2. I watched Without Warning last night. I watched Without Warning last night. God damn, is that movie bad, but I had fun watching it. Transfers 2. The plot is crazy. A dirty rowdy boy and you expect me not to want that. <laughs> Transfers 2, I like the plot, I just don't like the way the movie is executed. To be very, to be very honest, I, I like the way the first movie was executed. I do like the plot of this one though, and it, I think it's fucking crazy. I'm just like, what? How are they doing? What? They're getting away with this? They're getting away with this. They're getting away with this in the dumbest way, but I don't hate it. And um, what else? But like I said, oh, What's happening? And never, ever, never again. 
They came for our mothers and then for our kids, scratching the girls and eating us in, changing God's work, a seed to begin. We burn them with fire and kill them with men. Let us remember. What the fuck never is again. happening? How good is the 50s alien in the Star Wars world? In a post Star Wars world? I was like, what is that, dude? I was watching that. I'm like, look how, look how big his head is and how tiny his face is compared to his freaking body. Ooh, did I bump into that? Was there an earthquake? Why is my desk shaking? Okay, it's not an earthquake. I bumped into it. I was like, what the heck is that, dude? They couldn't even get a good costume for the freaking hunter. Are you serious? Yeah, the plot, the plot for transfers to his bonker balls. Yeah, at the start, dude. Oh my god. Your of choice does it again. I, I like, I like how, um, she is oh so, 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 so I like how they basically, <laughs> what's his name? Nolte is just like, yo, dude, what are you talking about? It's like, yeah, what's his, what's his name had a brother? It's like, when did he have a brother? I'm like, yeah, when did he have a brother? And how, why did you fail to mention it? He, he, he literally asked, asked the questions we were thinking when that happened. We're like, what is the, what? even he couldn't believe it. Yeah, there's even a Star Wars blanket at the fucking movie. Yeah, I noticed that. And they chose the 50s alien. Okay, I gotta know. Gotta know what. Oh! Hold up! Hold up, you know what also confused the crap out of me, Kraft? What's his name? How hard did you laugh when death is driving the golf cart killing the first lot of transfers at the start? That shit was ridiculous. That was... <laughs> I was like, okay, okay. I clapped. I was like, yes, more of this. More of this silliness. I want this. Uh, it's stupid, but I want it. I, it's stupid, but I want it. <laughs> he just pulls out. He's like, surprise, bitch. Bang, 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 bang. <laughs> I was like, what? This is ridiculous, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Hanging out the side, firing for real. Dude, it was actually really good. The one thing I don't like about the movie, and it's, 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 the thing is, I can't say it's small because it happens every time when they're ever fucking characters are talking to each other. It's just a close up headshot back and forth. A cam, B cam, sometimes C cam of just them talking to each other. They're looking straight into the camera and it's not fun to look at. It's like, why? This is so off putting. I don't like it. That's like the one thing I don't like about the movie. And I that's. But the rest of the movie fucking great yeah the shots are bs but the rest of the movie is fucking great i had fun the, it, but it kept really taking me out of it whenever they talked and they did those stupid shots and i'm like why are they doing that they had a good thing in the first one what if the fuck is it not the same director is it someone who worked in uh in soap operas or fucking tv like what is this yes yes what was that what was that craft what was that that was so weird I did not like that. By the way, by the way, where, when did when did when when did what, what's his name uh, get money? He was homeless from the start. How did he get all this money? How did how did how did how did he get all that money? Who's giving him the money? He was a broke baseball player that was a has been. How did he get all this? How did he get all this wealth? I never knew how much I wanted to see Helen Hunt's nose hairs. For real, dude. Helen Hunt is kind of cute though. Let's be honest. I was like, hmm. Helen Hunt is very underappreciated at this time. But also, you know what's. Serotonergic receptors are present in your principal vascular system. So, anyways, before I was interrupted, what, I'm surprised Helen Hunt was in this movie, especially like in 90. Let's see, 85, 91? She was kind of big already at that point, or she was very. She was well known. She was more known than before.
I think the idea is he no longer spends it on booze, so he has more. That's not how it fucking works. <laughs> he has a fucking mansion now. I'm surprised she came back for the sequel. I was like, Profanity, what? Derogatory comments or other well, importantly, he has a fire truck. He's, <laughs> he's doing a, like, why? Yeah, for that one thing in the movie. Yes, craft. Ew, what is this? Extracted PDT? What the fuck is that? Ah! I'm back. It's been cut open. Of course! They must have manually removed the PDTs. That's why the security systems were reset and medical. Oh, the bodies. The bodies in the crew quarters. They were skinned. The creatures were using the PDTs to move through secure areas. <laughs> oh no! Crap! Crap! I had the same question. I had the same question. I'm like, when is he gonna fuck? This dude's like 80 years old already at this point. When is he gonna fucking have a baby? Who did he fuck? When did he fuck? What are you saying? I was so confused when I saw him. Like, he is old. Does he not have a kid yet? It's the only way, unless you space jump between decks. This is surgery. John, prep the pole. I had the same question. Why did they not go back 20 years earlier? I don't know. See, that's the thing. He... Jack... Death, Death himself was like, yo... I gotta protect you so that way you can fuck, have a baby, and the lineage is protected now. And I'm like, yeah, but when is he gonna do that? The dude's about to fucking croak any moment now. The f yeah, dude, she was so good. She was so fucking good. I was like, oh my god, girl, dude, you actually, you're actually really good. It's fucking great. <laughs> She was like, she was, uh, she, I can't, I, is she the best performance in that movie? Yes, sure, why not? I feel like she is. She's, she has to sell the characters that she's McNulty, and she's doing it spot on. She is so good. <laughs> uh, I'm surprised that I saw the dude from uh, Reanimator in there, even though it was a smaller role, but he, I, I recognize him even with a shitty goatee. I'm like, hey, that's the doctor from Reanimator. I know him. Did you like the forklift scene? Fuck, dude. I was like, how, 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 how's, how's Jack Death gonna get out of this? Oh, the, t the, 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 the 10 second time loader thing. Oh, okay. That was amazing. Awesome. Awesome fucking thing. Uh, Isaiah Al Rajkupar. Oh, by the way, everybody, I cheated a little bit and, well, I didn't cheat. I looked at the videos, like the walkthroughs of this. There's a guy that beat this in three hours. I'm I'm at the part where he's in this fucking game for like an hour and a half. Meaning I'm slow as shit and he's not wasting his fucking time reading the PDAs. But me being a dumbass needs to fucking read and what the hell is he see what's going on over here. <laughs> Which they don't even remind you of. They, yeah they do. Don't they remind you that he has one? Well, I mean they don't really say that. No, they do. They bring it up. It's like, hey, isn't that the thing that is it still 10 seconds? Yep, it's still 10 seconds. <laughs> January 8th, the new year for the chief surgeon and the new year for the staff of medical deck. Yeah, you're, you, they kind of vaguely bring it up. They're kind of like, oh, yeah, yeah, sure, whatever, move on. <laughs> I, have to, I have to think of it that way or it gets rather confusing. The staff and the medical deck now consist of three extra sections, cybernetics, tissue regeneration, and for some reason, medical hydroponics. Yes, it may be medical, it may be medicinal, but as I told Dr. Milan, they are still plants. I don't wish to seem ungrateful. It is Kane Corporation who opened so many new doorways for me and who redefined the frontiers of this medicine for, all of, for us all. As a man who served his apprenticeship on the battlefields, elbows deep in the blood of innocence to see those deserts, 
and war-torn villages reborn as images of nirvana is a privilege whoa what the fuck is this rambling going on and all thanks to the science of Cain. and yet it's hard to understand why on the groom lake so many departments are being forced to share resources like this i hear our budget will be up to for review soon and the chances of us getting an increase are slim i shall try to remain positive considering the exposition dump at the start and they don't bother to go over something that that is quite big to that part of the plot sure yeah that exposition dump was something though i was like mm. I don't know about I don't know about like it's it's cool that they got it's cool that they got everybody back. It's pretty great. I mean, so, I, it looks like a lot of them didn't have a lot of work to do, so they're like, yeah, sure, fuck it, why not? I come back. I come back for uh, I come back for the the, the role that of that I played six years prior. It's fucking great, awesome. I do love him saving the first wife by grabbing her strap. Yes! Oh my god, dude. Craft, what the frick, dude? What the frick was that all about? Oh my god. <laughs> I, this was this was me. This was me the entire time when that happened. I was like, what? I was like, what is this? Just fucking... Uh, that was me this entire time. I was just like all poggies and shit, dude. I was like, I was Keg W in poggies. <laughs> Uh, I was like fucking wheezing, dude. I'm like, what? Take her off of that. Why are you doing this? <laughs> February 18th. My goodness, a 300% budget increase. I have not yet been able to imagine how helpful this financial windfall will be. Dr. Milan assured me that a stable, that a sizable portion of this budget will be applied to Project Seed. It makes out our work that much more essential. We'll order new equipment and new samples, although I don't totally agree with the ethics of Dr. Milan's acquisition of volunteers for surgery and testing. The leaps and bounds we've made in our research more make up for the rest of it. it is it wrong that we must test to the limits of mor morality for the greater good? Good movie. It was a fun movie. By the way, how's everybody's day, Craft and River? How are your days? How's your day going so far? Jesus Christ. I got too into the fucking movie discussion. I never asked how you guys are doing right now. Hope you're having a good day. <laughs> May 4th, I'm a surgeon who has been have seen many awful things in the blood-soaked abattoirs of the Pangea Wars. Pangea Wars? Wait, so did Earth become Pangea once again? So perhaps this should be second nature to me, but I don't recall agreeing to the use of children for testing. You fell down the chancellor's hole, sorry. <laughs> I'm doing great. I actually uh, had an eventful day. I went out with my dad. Me and my brother, my sister all went out. Uh, we all had breakfast with him for a late Father's Day thing. He was so busy, so he couldn't really do anything. So today we we went out with him for, for breakfast. So it was fun. It was actually pretty nice. I went to inspect the stasis tubes at the request of my chief nurse and found that there were several children, some as young as nine years old, awaiting processing. Children? I was shocked and appalled and demanded an explanation from Dr. Milan. Edward Jenner had to test vaccines on children to see if they work, he said. I knew the story. What medical does not? It was nice. It was actually really nice. Uh, Jenner injected infected pur purulent exodus into the child's arm which must have seemed callous disregarding for the child's life and yet it saved the boy that is how he convinced me we are at the frontier of the sciences chances must be taken i do not always feel comfortable with his ethical choices but his logic is sound the research is too valuable for us to let a few moral qualms get in our way okay sure asshole but yeah, uh, I watched Transfers today. I, I watched Transfers and finished it before I started streaming. That was fun. That was a fun movie. But last night I was watching Without Warning. God damn, that movie's shit. But you know what? I didn't hate it. That movie was shit, but I did not hate it. But it, it, I didn't know it had, um, what's his name? What's his name? Fuck, what's his name? What's his name? Damn it. I need to look it up. I need to look it up. What's his name? Not something Mitchell. Let's see. Without... Without warning, it stars him. What's his? He well, he doesn't star him, but he's in it. 
No, not Jack Palance. Dude, what the fuck? My phone's like going off. It's not Joe Taylor. That's not his real fucking name. What's his name? It has Martin Landau, dude. Yeah, it does have Martin Landau. <laughs> That was weird, though. I was like, what the fuck? Martin Landau's in here? Cameron Mitchell. There you go. Cameron Mitchell's in here. Yeah, I was like, what the fuck? Cameron Mitchell's in everything. What the hell? He was in a lot of shit back then. I get him and Jack Palance confused all the time. I'm sorry. Uh, Yeah, Jack Palance. I always get him confused. They look alike when they're older. David fucking Caruso, dude. My God, it it had it had quite a it had a few names in there. I was like, okay, too bad this movie kind of sucks. <laughs> Puts on sunnies, dude. Okay, that was him, right? Okay, I was like, that's not the dude from from uh, CSI Vegas, is it? That's not him. There's no fucking way it's him. There's no fucking way. Or CSI Miami, my bad. Fucking, did I say Vegas? The fuck am I talking about? I keep getting this. I was like, that's him. There's no fucking way. It looks like him. There way There's no way it can be him. I fear my decisions to become a surgeon with Kane Corporation. Also, by the way, this is how I end up fucking padding the time. As you can see, I have like a whole entire essay to fucking read and I'm here fucking talking about shitty movies <laughs> that I enjoyed. I fear that my decision has become to become a surgeon with Kane Corporation is not quite simple as I thought. The first casualties of the infection spreading across the ship came to my lab. We where we had to set up the quarantine operating room. I had to get the hands on with a patient for the first time in years. Uh, the flow of blood, the cutting of infection, infected tissue using my specialized tools. God forgive me, but I enjoyed it. Looks like him, smells like him, tastes like him. Must be him. It looked like him. I honestly thought, I'm like, wait a minute. Is that really him? It kind of looks like him. Come on. No freaking way. <laughs> it's impossible to explain that adrenaline rush from playing God in such a way of having the lives of so many of the verge of death in your hands. I felt it on the battlefields, and I feel it now. It is not the beauty of birth that moves me it seems but the pungent stench of death i thought i joined kane corporation to save my soul instead it was to slake the thirst of the beast in me whose jaws slaver at the scent of blood i am ashamed are you though it's not the greatest executed story but the filming is great the panoramic shots oh boy oh yeah it was shot pretty good it was shot pretty well I was like, okay, you know what? For for being a shitty movie, it at least it it, it 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 looks good at least. I'll give it that. I'll give it that. It looks pretty good. I'll it, it, I'll give it that. It looks pretty good. Um, to be honest, while the special effects are kind of cheesy, especially with the with the with the with the meaty discs. I, I don't hate the way they look. I actually did enjoy them. I'm like, oh, it makes sense what they do, but I don't understand what their purpose is. Like, I get they're supposed to clamp on to the victim and, like, hurt them, but then what? They're just, like, eating away and that's it, I guess. But why doesn't, why doesn't the alien have a laser, you know? I don't understand. I think I had some issues through development. So, oh, I had some issues through development. Uh, changes, so it changes the story, but the shots don't make sense in some parts. I think so as well. It gets kind of weird. It does get kind of like discombobulated at points. Only the one dude thinks to cut the flesh frisbee. Yeah, right. <laughs> uh, how could I not seen it? Those awful life forms are disguising themselves as us inside us. 
They wear our skins, our PDPs, which explains how the security system cannot detect them. If I didn't already know where those creatures came from, this would perhaps be less frightening, but they've learned the vile abominations. Abomination, what a word that is. It appears to summarize what uh, we have created in our hubris. We have created evil. God help us all. Everyone dies. Everyone else dies? No. I mean, that one, the, the, the girl at the end didn't die. But yeah, a lot of people did die. You know, surprisingly, the body count's kind of small, though. The two people in the beginning, the Scoutmaster, uh, the two friends, so that's five. Uh, no, er no, everyone who got hit by flesh frisbees? Yeah, they. that's weird. I don't understand that. Yeah, yeah, okay, see, that's what I mean. I'm like, okay, well, why, why, why is Cameron Mitchell surviving all these attacks? Cutting it up. It's like, is there a special poison that's inside them or something? And, but he already got bit. Wouldn't he be have been injected by the poison? I don't understand. Like, I don't understand their purpose. I know what they do, but I don't understand their purpose. And like I said, why doesn't the alien hunter have a laser? Dear all for those who are still able to receive the messages on the internet. Uh, you'll know by now that the creatures are using PDTs to process past security checkpoints. Uh, to prevent this, I have decided that each yada 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 ages. Okay, that's the same one. They all have that same fucking email. I don't care. My God, Doctor Guidelines of for Project C is specifically the requirement for any female subjects who have previously been pregnant. The female subjects should ideally have been screened, but the, their precise source is not important. Since the project has to be 99.89% chance of non-fatal reaction in subjects, members of staff will be eligible for this test. The ideal subject is as follows. Type O, uh, 556, free of any genetic defects, whatever the fuck that means. Eight, between 18 and 40, subjects have, must have recently been pregnant, ideally within the past year. Hmm, interesting. I like I like how at the end of the movie Cameron Mitchell when he charges at the alien he just screamed alien I'm like what is dude I was fucking laughing so hard I'm like Cameron Mitchell what happened <laughs> that script so good alien <laughs> he just screams alien like why <laughs> We have disagreed often, but never so more than now. I'm aware that Miss Callister doesn't work in surgery and the chief nurse boxer has seniority in terms of rank. However, Callister has one of the most extraordinary organizational minds I've ever worked with. The product storage areas are clean, yada, yada, yada. therefore I have to challenge your demand that I remove her from the position because these false reports she has been sending you about anomalies in the supply. I have no doubt about your claims of her illicit, illicitly taking samples is also an uh, uh, she is fine worker and the reports only she is right regards Isaiah okay moving on I do like the dude with PTSD is right about almost about almost every <laughs> it's right but almost fucks up everything yeah true oh dude i'm like yeah you're right but you're also wrong like i don't I, you idiot prepared for the selective program. This is a friendly reminder that Fort Prime does not entail death. This is a final request for the breathing unit to report to communications directly. I don't think this will fit. Let's see.
okay, I no longer have the oxygen tank, so like, what is it, mine? I can try to make it fit, but it may break. I don't know what I was thinking there. Uh, no. Crazy. Okay, uh... I think that would break. It said it wouldn't fit, and now I don't have the oxygen tank, so where'd it go? You lying sack of shit. No. Crazy. I don't know what I was thinking there. This isn't gonna work. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch Split Second next. I have to sign up for Tubi though, because I'm like, what the fuck? My TV wouldn't let me watch it. It's like, you need to register. I'm like, why? Just fucking let it. Let me just watch it. Listen, I can't be scared right now. I can't be bothered with because I'm trying to look for whatever the fuck is going on here. That's just crazy. Although. Maybe if it... No. No, that won't work. I wonder how Split Second is. It had Rutger Hauer in it. Rutger Hauer looks pretty cool in some of this movie. I know he's a, he came out in the game. I forget what it's called. I think it's like Observer or some shit. I, I wanted to check that out. Look cool. Kane Corporation. The last truly great company wants to thank all employees for their dedicated service. This year's profits are up 20% across all sectors. Life expectancy is up five years. We are at the cusp of greatness. In the words of Henry Kane himself, humanity has chosen us to do it. It clearly has some changes throughout production too, but it's very good. Ooh. Sounds kind of rocky though. I feel bad for him sometimes. Like, I guess his very his most well known role is in in I almost said cyberpunk in fucking in Blade Runner, right? Everyone knows, him, but he after that he, if, before and after that he was in like these fucking B grade eighty sci fi movies that are just like damn, dude. Nah, it's just the little things if you actually dissect scenes. Oh, okay. It's like. He deserved more. He deserved more. He deserved better. when he was a pro tag the movie is be great <laughs> true I think he honestly deserved better I don't know what I was thinking there I can try to make it fit but it may break I wanted him to be a Jillian, which he wasn't into. What's that? What's a Jillian? Hmm.
A villain? Oh. I mean, I feel like he could do the pro tag roles pretty well as well. Like, if they gave him the chance. It's just that he did such a good job as a villain that everyone's like, he should be the villain. Did I fuck up something? I feel like I did. Because I can't see shit. I don't know what the fuck it wants me to do. Oh, this is redhead talk f fucked up my autocorrect. You know what? I, I understand. He's great in all his roles, true. I have not seen a lot of his movies, but the stuff that I've seen, a few of it, it's pretty good. Yeah, that is true. You are absolutely right. He's like, what's wrong with just wanting to fucking live, dude? Like what 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 can you do knowing that you're about to expire? Like you, I don't know <laughs> it's funny because he's like what you expect me to be rational kind of thing. This should be useful. I can try to make it fit, but it may break. Well, and he's very childlike in his understanding too, true. I don't know what I was thinking there. Yeah, because he wasn't alive for that long. Medtech Surgical Pot is not properly prepared for the selective program. Yeah, like four years they retire them. Yeah, true. Where can I get stasis fluid? How good are cheese and tomato jaffles? I don't know. Never had them. I don't feel like they're an American thing either. Toasties? You mean like grilled cheese and tomato soup or something? Like what? cheese and tomato sandwich dude they're actually pretty bomb i do like my i do like my grilled cheese with onions though like fried onions you don't have any you don't what you don't have any onions Just fry up some tomatoes or something. Or like, like grill up the tomatoes would be dope. You settle for some aioli instead? Nice. Why won't it work? 
can't see it working like that. This isn't gonna work. I don't know what I was thinking there. <laughs> the dude's an idiot. Mm. What am, what am I missing here? Hold up, let me go let me go blow my nose. Let me go blow my nose. I'll be back real quick. Okay, okay, I am back. Uh, I can't wait for dinner. I, I skipped out on lunch because surprisingly, even though the sandwich was pretty small, I am, uh, I got full. Like, I, to the point where I skipped lunch. So I'm going to have a pretty sizable dinner, which is fine. So I can't wait for that. I'm going to grill the bread up with some mayo on there and shit. Uh, what's for tea? I think, uh, I don't know how to say it in English, but it's essentially a sandwich. Um, the, with the cut of meat called Milanesa. It's like a very thin meat that you, uh, you fry up. So I'm going to put like some tomato, avocado, some, uh, some bean some bean puree in there um lettuce tomatoes some onions maybe if i'm in the mood but i have avocado so i'm gonna put that shit too and queso fresco so that shit's a whole hearty meal for me You know, for being in space, I still don't understand why there's light, thunder and lightning, but I'm assuming it's because we're in the planet. That's like a schnitzel, right? Yeah, it kind of is like a schnitzel. Yeah, you're right. But I don't I don't bread it and fry it up. I just, like, put it in the pan and then fry it up in the oil. But not, like, to the point where the oil is covering up the meat. It's, like, very little. It just covers the bottom. That's it. I could I could fry it up too with like I could cover it in breading and then that would be dope too but I don't know I don't want any so this breading is too much Your bar of choice does it again Puddle of Mud has an all new synth stripper she is oh so 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 hot visit us at Crew Quarters Sigma Okay listen Dude, I've been streaming for like a fucking hour. I've read two PDAs and I'm trying to figure out where the fuck the stasis is. Cause I got this shit. I got this shit. Empty stasis fluid container. What, do I use it on me? Mm, probably not a good idea. At least we had a good talk for transfers too, and, and uh, without warning. At least I'll give it that. No, that's ridiculous. Sure it is. Sure it is, John. Hmm. Probably not a good idea. I don't know what I was thinking there. 
Maybe if it... No. No, that won't work. Next stop, split second? Yeah. I'll talk about split second. God damn, dude. Like, I don't hate this fucking game, but there's just some... It, it does that point and click bullshit thing where it's like, you gotta really figure it out. It's like, oh my god. There's so much fucking PDAs as well. I hate these fucking PDAs. Why, what's in the organic receptacle, though? Like, you, what? what's the deal with that? I don't know what I was thinking there. Put the gun in there. Fuck it. That's just crazy. Although... Put the gun in here. I don't think that'll work. Put this on the gun. I don't know what I was thinking there. No, it's not scary when I'm pissed off. <laughs> it's not scary when I'm pissed off. I don't know what I was thinking. Man. I swear to God, do I, I have to see it working like that? Can you actually look at shit like what in first person? No. So the only reason why the force field is up is because it thinks I am is because I have the the fucking tags. I have these tags. Or I have my own tags in in me and I'm supposed to take it out. It doesn't work like that. Gun. Hmm. These don't go well together. No, like in most adventure games, so you know what it, what the fuck you need to do. Uh. No, it doesn't do that. So I know, I know I have to, it kind of gives you context clues anyways. Um, so like I picked up the thingy here, oh, I, I got here and it's like, you gotta get rid of your thingy so you could do the thingy to get in the thingy. I'm like, all right, I got these thingies here. They're all lit up kinda. And uh, so let me do that. I got this, I got that, but now I have this and I don't know what the fuck to do with it. <laughs> What's the level called? I honestly don't know. I, I don't even know what the fuck the level's called. Let's see. Let's load the game, right? Shit. It doesn't even really have it. There's no level names to it. Medical? I guess it's Medical Bay. Yeah, I think this is technically the Medical Bay. Am I supposed to be here? No, this is gun control. Okay, well that's over. That's over and done with. Time to crawl back. You got it. Okay, let's go. Ah, itchy, itchy, itchy. 
Is there like some random tiny bullshit in here? Nope, it doesn't look like it. Oh, wait a minute, what was that? There was something here. Oh, blood. Blood fam, blood. Bad little ting. Have I picked up the extracted PDA and used it on the terminal? Oh, you mean the P the PTD? Are you serious? It's like that's all I had to fucking do? Walk to this. Elizabeth Swanson. Absolutely. Oh my god, absolutely fucking annoying. We were here for like a fucking hour. Discord says, discarded stasis pod. Thank you, thank you for the help. Ah, yes. Tia, a survivor. Is someone alive? Not exactly. He's in stasis. Thank Every you, Kraft. Every day from stasis without the proper procedures being followed. So who the hell woke me? Forget him, John. You need to think about the mission. like remember any of this I don't know torn apart door I don't like that well this is utterly destroyed I think that would break I guess let's go that way. Ew, legs. A human torso. Oh, stasis pod chip. Give me. Another body. Two. Uh, Burke Carter. Here we go with the fucking reading. Four. Destroy what? Destroy, 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 destroy. What the heck is this for? Okay, whatever. Uh, but you still my beating heart. I saw the most divine creature in hydroponics. She's my, f she's friends with that nurse Erica. Erica gives me the evil eye, but Sadie, Sadie is just a divine thing. Curves in all the right places and the face of an angel. I keep trying to come up with reasons to visit the medicinal hydroponics section. She never sees me though. I'm not trained medical staff. These soldier, those soldiers in the recovery rooms give me funny looks and I'm at the window trying to get her attention. I have to find a way to speak to Sadie directly. I've seen her head to the decontamination room 
room and she seems to go there after every shift. I might try to strike up a conversation by one of the machines, maybe offer to buy her a drink. I'll do it tomorrow or maybe the day after because tomorrow I've got a double, <laughs> got a double shift. Still, it takes a brave man to work on unknown sciences in the bosom of the cosmos, doesn't it? Like, the jocks back at school would never, would ever be able to do what I friggin' do. I risk my life, I risk life and limb to prepare essential electronics and that takes courage. I may not be a soldier, but I think I have the right to call myself a man of courage. Okay. Must be Karen Gillen. <laughs> uh, let's see. What's with the shutdown? Jesus, nine days now. I've been trying to get through the surgical pause for a week. I gave up trying to trying to go try going to I gave up going to hydroponics to see Sadie after they started restricting the access to unnecessary personnel so now i just hang around product storage by the vending machines hoping to see her but when i do i just choke up damn i'm so pathetic i'm reading the book i'm reading the book by arian sanchez it's about the eugenics war it's freaking amazing that we're even allowed to do what we do on the groom lake uh what with that what happened all those years ago I have to hide the book though. Dr. Milan saw me reading it in the rec room and he went totally ape shit, threatening to turn threatening to burn the book and fire my ass. Why? So now it stays under my pillow and I sure as hell don't take it out of my rounds. Instead I bring one of the pa Pangean series by W C Dark with me. Is that his real name? Doubt it. I love Major Pluto Major Pluto? Pluto? I don't know. He's incredible. Sometimes wish I had the balls to be in the Marines rather than engineering. I'd love to be like him. Okay. Fucking loser. Rations arrived. Nobody's impressed. Uh, it's all emergency shit so hardly gourmet, but man, I wasn't expecting much, but this is seriously bad. Because food short people are going bug, bug fuck Lotus Punch. Punch Malone? What the hell? Lotus Punch Malone broke the poor bastard's nose. Steve is having trouble keeping everyone's fist off each other. I keep asking why can't we just raid hydroponics, but they keep shouting me. They keep shouting me down, especially Sadie. She looks so pissed when she sees me, but nowhere near as pissed as when she looks at Dr. Milan and Dr. Al Raja Kupar. Rush Cooper, okay. She must despise me. Why didn't I just ask her out before? Because you're a coward, Merc. A dirty, stinking coward. Uh, the power went out again. I'm so freaking scared I can barely breathe. Those rumors of animals prowling around medical? Not rumors. I saw one guy ripped apart by one of those things. Couldn't make it out too well. Pale skin, tails, I think. They move around like a pack of dogs and they're, they're strong. People are scared and hungry. I kept a small stash of food in my quarters. I didn't even tell Steve about it. I feel ashamed to keep for keeping it to myself, but people are getting crazy, man. I think it might be actually a, be against regulation toward food. Migleta? Miglietta would kill me if he knew I had rations hidden. Come on, the guy is nuts. He's practiced, he practically strangled me the other day. Carso had to restrain him. Body still freaking kill. Body still freaking kills from the operation earlier. Steve was nominated to be reprogrammed the security turrets. Okay, and the guy just went and did it. He's here, not like me. Yo, what up, Liam? You're so fricked. <laughs> oh, you're not fricked. How are you doing, Liam? How are you? Welcome, welcome, dude. How's your day? How's your day? Hope everything was good today, Liam. You play some Binding of Isaac. You won. Some, you won some games. You lost some games. You're good. That's good. Now I'm not just a coward. I'm a freaking murderer. I use those poor bastards in stasis to keep those godful awful things from getting to me. I just unlocked the stasis units and began the recovery process. So that when they staggered out of the deep freeze those things were waiting for them i found a product storage room and nobody was using it locked myself in when the breach was reported i heard the screams i pissed myself i fucking pissed myself is that a way for a real man to behave you just stopped down by to say hi okay liam i appreciate you stopping by and saying hi even if it is for a little bit as i ran i saw sadie cr cradling her best friend's bloodied body in the corridor. The worst freaking part isn't that it's never occurred to me to stop. 
See you, Liam. Thank you for stopping by. Have fun with Binding of Isaac, dude. Hope you win a couple rounds, though. Because you're getting pretty good. You're getting pretty good at it. I just hope they buy me time I need to find a hiding place. That's who Burke Carter was, whoever finds this. Uh, and I know somebody will. He was, he was a coward. I just hope that the computer parts in this PDA come in handy for whoever finds this. If my hide was this useless in life, at least I can hope that it's something I left behind was useful. Okay, whatever. Uh, ages. No, no, it's one. Okay, it says legs, so give me the friggin' legs. Step one is that one. What? Three doses of that. Is that four doses? Is that what that means? So for the head, that's the thingy that... Okay. Or is that the steps? Frick. So one dose of this H3CN. Is it? Ooh, my bad. So this is good. So what's this one? Am I supposed to follow these steps? Let me save. Because I don't want to fucking end up doing this like the wrong way. Let's see. Uh, three? Where's that for the torso? Like, I don't understand what this is.
Let's see now. Four of these. So that's for the head. CH, CH, okay. What is this for? One of these. So the head's good, I guess. So now I gotta figure out the rest of the body. And, uh... Yo, what up, crap? Yeah. Getting pretty weird. <laughs> yeah, dude, I am not gonna lie. Uh, let's see. Yeah, they, they do not. Um, just one shot of this. Okay. I don't... Okay, three shots of those. What are you playing after this? I honestly don't know. I have no idea. I'm not gonna do another point and click for a while, I don't think. So I do need three of these. Ugh, four of those on the head. I think I already did that. Okay. Can I get like more than one hint? Or like these these are the only hints here? Like fifty percent the other the other half of the puzzle is missing. One, two, three, four, three, four, five, six. Yeah, the other half of the puzzle's missing. Like what's the deal with this? 
How do I, how do I confirm that it's all good? Does he just do it automatically? I, I don't understand. Okay, I, there's that. That's one injection, whatever the fuck that means. Let's see. I, I know that pretty much if it only has this one, if it only has this one, that's pretty much the only one I could do, which is that one. So it only needs one. to keep it alive. Are there more bits to pick up in this room? I don't think so. I think I got pretty much everything in there. Like, I can't really pick them up. All I could do is just look. I try to pick this up. It says legs. I try to pick up the legs, but it gives me a PDA. See, which I'm like, I don't give a fuck about. Oh, well, here's another one. Four. What's that? I still don't know what the rest of this is, but we'll see what it is. Uh, NHC. Okay. Do the other pods have the correct sequences? I'm not sure. I think they're a hint. But it doesn't, as you can see here, it has this. And it has how many injections you're supposed to give. So if you find this, you're basically, that's how many. Because, like, I don't even know where the fuck to go with this. Like, I already got this one. I only give it one injection. One, one, one dose. This requires four doses, and that's for the head. But other than that, I don't know what the fuck, dude. See, there, there's this thing. Try doing those three things to the body. I did. I found it right here. Here's one that requires four doses. Here's this one that requires three doses. And then there's a uh, there's another one. There's this one that requires one dose. I already found them all. That's what I mean. Like half the puzzle is missing. I found this the head. I found the torso, and I found the the, the legs. Like make them the same. I can't. I can't make them the same. Like you're talking about the molecular sequences. I can't do them. They they they're not the same. Do the PDAs have the others? No.
I don't... Time to cheat. <laughs> Time to cheat. Time to cheat. Yeah, walkthrough says do the three from the pods. The other two are in the PDAs. What the fuck does that even mean, dude? The last one I have to guess. Oh my fucking god. Are you serious right now? Which PDA though? Is it this one? This guy is not medical though. There's that one. Yeah, but he's a janitor though. He doesn't work in this. Let's see, maybe this one. This report that's in here. Five. Uh, H O zigzag and okay. Is three. This one requires one. Okay, let's see. We already got. We need one more. We need one more, and I need to figure it out.
steady yourself. You'll be okay. God damn it. They heard screaming. I woke him up. I woke the survivor. He, he didn't make it. I don't care. I think I killed him. Good. I think I did something. Oh well. I told you to leave him. He was dead the minute they froze him. You just made his death easier. Simpler. Oh no, it sounded like he was fighting. It, it didn't sound it didn't sound easier. Just killed a man, Tia. You need to move before you become another dead body. Oh, not about killing a man. Mercy. Mercy. You have no idea how much mercy I have. I've been in hell. Made, made choices that got people killed. This isn't just about you anymore. Uh... I'm sorry. I need you, John. So, so sorry. Okay. Hang on, wait a minute. Hold, hold the fucking phone. Wasn't like the whole point of this so I could put this fucking thing in there so I could get the fluid? Like what? What? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. What? What? Okay, whatever. Mm. Fucking clod, I swear to God. Well, can I? I can't. Is was 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 all was all was all this was all this really just to wake this this guy up just so he could fucking die literally within the next? Oh, there it is. Okay, let's uh hurry it up. Their surgical pot is not properly prepared for the selective program. I don't think this will fit. Okay, now what? Do I gotta get that fucking thing back? Oh, I can't pick it up, so it doesn't matter. All right. Uh, I tried to pick up the leg, but it's not letting. It's not letting me pick up the leg. Sorry, I had a hiccup. Have I played Katana Zero? No, I have not. Can I? Can I not pick up the legs? Fucking matter. I have not played Katana Zero. Look cool though. Protein and fat storage container, so... It's on Game Pass? Right, get it. I got Overcooked 2 for free yesterday, but it was on Epic Games. 
as much as I don't want to use Epic Games as a as a as a browser, I think it's like I mean as a thing to get games. It's like okay, it's a good game. Me and my friends got really addicted to it. <laughs> to be honest, right now I'd rather play that right now at this point than this. Because there's so much fucking reading and these puzzles are like... Am I supposed to pick up the legs? Like, well, I don't... Okay, nah, I'm gonna I'm just gonna look it up right now. Let's see. This dude is like two hours into the game. I'm eight hours into the fucking game and here I am struggling. <laughs> Can you believe that shit? I don't know. Okay, fuck it. I don't know. I don't know. Just fucking go. Fucking done. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's not intuitive at all? I don't think so anymore. What's happening? He's moving on his own. Why? It's really it really feels like I'm playing fucking Harvester right now and I'm getting fucking little flashbacks as I speak. I already have, I have the fucking, ah, oh, no, never mind, I closed up the walk, yes, please, <laughs> I already got the oxygen tank, I already got the fucking a a anesthetics, I got the stasis, let's see, I keep thinking I have to pick up the legs that are right here, but that's fucking PDA, so it doesn't matter, just like, I, I need to pick up like some fucking thingy, I don't know what it is. Dude, freaking V is playing Metal Gear Solid 4 right now, and I swear to God, that game's nothing but cutscenes. He's gonna beat the, he's gonna beat that game with the cutscenes more than I am in this fucking game. Let's see. God damn it! God damn it! God damn it. <laughs> I'm gonna look it up right now. Let's see. Something sounds like it's burning. I think that's someone in the hallway that's cooking. Did I do something wrong? 
Did I do something? Did I fuck up already? Like, did I miss something? What is this? I doubt it. I don't know. I'm starting to doubt that I didn't do anything wrong. Okay. Hang on, wait a minute. Why is that la why is that one green? Why is that one green? Hold up, hold up, hold up. What the fuck? Who how did you get that one green? How did you get that one green? Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. How the fuck? Are you are you freaking kidding me, dude? Are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? There's like some other fucking substance here. Hold up. There's like some other fucking substance here. What the hell? What? What? Hold up. Where is it specifically? Because I can't fucking click on it. Oh my god, dude. Dude, crap. You won't you won't fucking believe this. You won't fucking believe this. So I have to fucking use the gun. I have to use the gun. I have to use the gun. What? Where did they get that? Where did they get that? Hold the fucking phone. Where is that? What is that? Hold up. Where'd you get that? No. No. Wait. Hold up. What is that? Where'd you get that? Where'd you get that fucking chunk? Where'd you get that chunk of meat? Hang on. Hang on. Hold up. Oh my god, quit reading this. Quit reading this. Go back. Come on. Come on. Come on, where'd you get that big chunk of meat at, dude? Where'd you get that big chunk of meat? Where'd you get that big chunk of meat? Quit reading the fucking thing, you asshole. No, he got it. Okay, he got it. He got it after that fucking whole part here. Okay, moving on. No, he has like a chunk of meat. He has a chunk of meat. I don't know where he got it from, though. The meat comes from the tray. What tray, though? Like, I used the gun on the fucking thing. And there's like nothing there. He actually has a... See, there's nothing here. I have to find the fucking flesh bag.
Blood stains, blood stains, blood stains. What container, though? Use the container on the liquid on the floor. Back in the room. I already have it. I already installed it. I already ha I already installed it. I just need the fucking meat bag. That's all I need. I'm just fucking skipping through all this fucking nonsense right now. Because what the fuck. No, that's the thing I'm looking for. What the fuck? Am I supposed to, like, bash him with the fucking thing? Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Where's the body part? You talking about the leg? I can't pick up the leg. That's the problem. Oh, wait. Let me use the fucking the gun to break the leg. That's no, that's ridiculous. You mean the leg's here? I can't fucking pick it up. It won't let me fucking do it. This isn't going to work. Where's the body part at? That's the thing. That's the thing I'm looking for. Oh my friggin' god, dude. You can go kiss my ass. What the fuck? Craft. Craft. Look where it's at. Look where it's at. Where do you see it here? Where do you see it here? PDA. PDA. Blood stains everywhere. What the fuck? Where is it at? Where is it at? It's right fucking here. Fucking kiss my ass, dude. The fuck is that? What the fuck is that, dude? Oh my god, man. Fucking whatever, man. Put it on the fucking tray. Yeah, I know how to use the gun. I'm like, god damn, dude. I'm so fucking pissed. Why is the gun making a slicing noise? It's fucking crushing it. The gun does not cut. It's so fucking stupid, dude. Straight up. Straight up. This is some fucking dumb bullshit. That is so fucking dumb. Almost two hours, dude, and I haven't advanced shit. Move out of the fucking way, buddy. You're going to have to be away from this. Oh, shut the fuck up. Oh Sorry. my god. Okay, just shit. Even be careful doesn't cover it. Yeah, good for you. I don't care. I don't fine. Oh my god. I should have saved. I should have saved. I should have saved. I should have saved. I'm about to cut into my spinal cord. I'm allowed one joke. I'll be monitoring. Deep breath, old man. You can do this. You have no idea, guys. Everybody is watching the VOD. I am so fucking sorry that I have to deal with Sierra, 80 Sierra gaming bullshit. That I suffered this VOD. I fucking ruined this VOD by wandering around for two fucking hours. Trying to find a fucking body part. I am Robin, the automated surgical med pod. Your physician has arrived. To ask any questions, you may feel some discomfort after the procedure, such as a headache or nausea. Let your nurse know if you are uncomfortable so that hey, they stop. may be given medication and or other treatment. Refrain from 
do this wrong, I die? Perfect. Am I supposed to do something here? What? I can't read anything. on your surgery, thank you. Oh look, it's eating that thing. It's eating the corpse. Thank you. One shot, one kill, BB. I got an achievement for that too. Subject alive, deceased alive. Rebecca, no. Rebecca, run. No. Rebecca, run. No. Rebecca, run. run. Do I pick this up? Okay, well, this is where the slow pacing starts even more because now I have lost the ability to run because I am hurt. Let's go over here.
Before we go down the elevator shaft, let's go over here. Take your time, John. Your bar of choice does it again. Puddle of Mud has an all new synth stripper. She is oh so 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 hot. Use it as a three quarter sigma. Something about a stripper being oh so 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 hot. Are you expecting a beautiful bouncy baby boy or girl? Speak to your nearest administrator for details on our Mom the Tots program. You could win an all expenses pay vacation to Titan. Competition is sponsored by the C team. One two the lap dance is always better when the stripper is crying. Yeesh. Well, slowly but surely we'll make our way to the elevator now. Because guess what? I wasn't supposed to be in here. Okay. <sighs> fucking stupid. Absol Before we fucking go any further. Before we go any fucking further. That's stupid. How the fuck are you gonna suspect that it's here? How would you know? How would you know? How would you know? The fuck? Okay, Dante. Why is that starting now? Level two, kitchen knife and snowflake are off limits. Why is that starting now? The thing has been happening for three months. Why is it starting now? Why did you call your cat annoying customer? Why did you call your cat annoying customer? That was a good joke, I remember that one. <laughs> Perfect. Where are you, John? What about the PDT? I can't track shit. Uh, hydroponics. Yeah. Well, what's left of hydroponics? The shaft's covered in growth. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, my shaft's covered in growth, too. Listen, wait. Let me check the blueprints. Yes. Hydroponics has a service elevator. Affirmative. Keep me in the loop. Does it matter which way do I go? I doubt it. Let's go this way. What is that? Some sort of insect. Keep your distance. It's tied up. Doesn't look like it can get loose. Tied up? How big is it? Big. Doesn't she fucking know? Doesn't she work in hydroponics? I don't understand. Okay, now, guess what? Have you seen termite queens? Yeah, it looks like a termite queen. Now, large swollen milk sack is what my fucking titties are. <laughs> milk cables. And when she's ready to die, they lick her to death. <laughs> Check them. Okay, I'm gonna thoroughly explore every fucking inch and corner of this stupid fucking game because now I gotta make sure that there's nothing stupid hidden and fucking collectible down here because some shit will fucking- Oh my god, dude. Let's just fucking go to the terminal. So fucking mad. Let's read the personal logs. More fucking reading. Akiza Tenshu. February 20th. Oh, praise God almighty. I couldn't be happier. Dr. DeGray took me to one of the 
took me one aside and told me that I was the only person who had skills and the ability to c take control of the nursery. He promoted me on the spot and said that I was now personally responsible for the queen. The royal jelly that she produced has proved to be incredibly useful. Oh, wow. Is it like slurm in Futurama? Because that shit's kind of gross if you guys are eating that shit. I discovered through my own analysis that not only is the jelly as an, an, essentially nutrient, an essential nutrient for the insect population, but that it has other amazing physical properties too. It accelerates molecular bonding in certain substances, acting as a thickener for many natural substances while also regenerating their natural properties. With some engineering, I imagine we can turn this into a true medical breakthrough. I imagine doctors in hospitals wards on, and on Earth using our bonding agent to heal wounds instantly. I, perhaps finally, the Tenchu name will be revered, revered in medical history instead of reviled. Aw, oh, ain't that some shit. Let's read more about what this bitch has to fucking say. The queen is a temperamental little thing. A fiery lady to be sure. Okay. Ah, uh, but queenie, you forget. I grew up in a family with more than one fire breathing dragon. I can handle my mother. I can certainly handle you. Ha. Huh? Although when she mil she's milked, she's rather docile. I dare say she's rather attached to me. I'm sure I... I heard her purring at me. What, you're gonna fuck this fucking thing or what? It's like roach. <laughs> Let's do some fucking reading. It's like roach milk. Good protein, sure. <laughs> uh, I'm aware that she's a bug and all, but it sounds rather like a, like approval. My parents keep hives of bees, so I've never been squeamish over insects. And I can tell the difference between aggression and favor. I'm still the only person who can get close without being bitten, and her bite can leave one hell of a mark. Let me tell you, Hodgkin said he'll report his side effects upon his return from sick leave. In other news, Dr. Myrick, one of Dr. Gray's subordinates, has requested samples of the jelly for experiments with his tree resin. In other words, he's going to fucking try to use it as lubricant, and he's going to try to see if he makes any growth happen down there by stimulation. I can see where this queen is coming from. True, if you milk me, I get docile. I can see where this queen is coming from. He thinks it might have used... Might have used an industrial adhesive. This is a little way from my original intention, but I sure, I suppose it's a start. I try so hard and got so far to be positive. Okay, I try so hard to be positive to be the person whose enthusiasm never once flags or fails. Uh, <laughs> But when you start hearing rumors that appall you to the, your very core, I tried to shrug it off, but recently uh, it's become harder to deny it. I've been hearing sounds from the elevator shafts, the sounds of wailing infants crying out in pain before suddenly being silenced. That is no rumor. Sometimes I lay awake at night and I swear I can hear the crying of children. I can't be dreaming. I saw Ingracia to confess my fears. He gave me a prescription to help me. Uh, but something in his eyes said that he knew I was hearing something real and worse. It was something he was hearing too. More rumors. Dr. Milan use, is using children in his research. I have to ignore it. If it were true, Kane could re remove, would remove him immediately. Surely even Dr. Gray appears to find it uncomfortable. Uh, this man is sleeping so easy. Isaac got his left cheek torn off by the queen. Okay. Uh, is Dr. Gray short staff again? Once again, I am being forced to manage multiple projects. Uh, only this time it's an examination of an ac acutely destructive new spore that seems to have infected the few pods. Uh, first observations, this parasitic fungus is, that grows faster than a common weed can and like a common weed. I feel it should be destroyed, but I know that Dr. Gray won't do it. He, like many other senior doctors, sees the new species as, a, as something to be exploited or weaponized. In the darkness, something stirs. I can say what I can't say what. I'm too afraid to find what it is. When Ivan and Theo disappeared a month back, we assumed they saw, somehow deserted. That was the official stance taken by Dr. Milan on the end of the board. Anyway, last night events proved that there's something on board with us, though God knows where it's from. See, this is what I mean. Like people are like, oh, these random people disappeared, or these random people are gonna get fired. It's like. Yes, but where are they gonna go? They're in the ship in the middle of outer fucking space. Where can they go? If they get if they get fired, where are they going? If they abandon their post, where are they going? What the fuck? It's a ship. It's a finite area. It's not like you're exploring a vast 
the vastness of the cosmos for these people. Jesus Christ. The queen was a is was more rambunctious than I've ever seen her, and milking her was certainly more challenging than I'm used to. Edmund was assisting. We've been short staffed, and some of our volunteers simply refusing to show for work. The queen's environment has been disturbed a great deal, and so her violent tendencies are more pronounced. Edmund was on his way to the hydroponics when it happened. A thing, something pulled him into the air ducts. I didn't see much. I saw him walking towards the de decontamination chamber, and the next moment his legs were kicking in the air. Whatever it was dragged him up and he, into the ceiling while he squealed like a pig. I'm resigning tomorrow. I did not sign up for mad science. I came to Cain. Oh, wow. You're gonna. You're really gonna fucking write up a resignation letter after you saw one of the staff members get fucking murdered in the vents? Is that how it works? Is that your fucking big moment of like, I'm resigning, dude. Like, I'm cordially write a letter to you say giving you my resignation okay instead of just saying fuck this i'm out i'm going to my fucking room I'm <laughs> i came to kane to serve humanity and clear my family's name what the fuck does that even mean not watch my crewmates die to be slaughtered by species that dr milan refuses to confirm or deny if only i resigned when i said i would if only they had ignored my demands if only they had ignored my demands to happen Infernal fungus destroyed. It's growing over me now, over my skin. It's burrowing into my flesh. The insect attacked again today, and it seems to only worse. And Dr. Gray was destroyed by a swarm of them, and now he is only fertilizer to them. Ever ravenous mole he was so curious about. The uninfected make are making an attempt to escape. That doesn't include me. The emergency flares keep the bugs away. I told them to give me the flare to hold back the bugs so they can get away. I hope they escape soon. This fungus is making my head feel funny. I sure can I sure can feel it grow I'm sure I can feel it growing through my ear canal. Foolish pranks. With the greatest respect, could you please <laughs> Monkas. Greatest respect, could you please stop the ridiculous pranks your group is insist on carrying out with the fertilization chambers? I will admit that they are hardly dangerous, but they are undignified. I certainly wouldn't like to, I certainly wouldn't like to be pres present with a cane inspector stumbles upon young Theodore racing in front of the queen, hands above his head while shouting, I'm covered in bees! It's unprofessional. Please instruct them to cease their foolish foolishness of once kind regards, Dr. Gray. Uh, don't worry, I don't think uh, that you're losing your mind. Ghosts are possibilities, but I suspect what you're hearing is perhaps the sound of devices playing in other parts of the ship. I do believe at the moment that the corporal world and spirit world, uh, the, corpor the corporeal world, corporal world, and uh, yeah, 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 yeah. so try to calm yourself. Nah, I'm fucking, I'm fucking absolutely oh, that was. Oh my god, there's more reading. Fucking. Wah! Haldi Dasa, no activity. Uh, heightened aggression, recommended milking. Yeah, no activity. Uh, let's activate the suction cup. Queen's milk. Perfect. Now, which way do we go? Oh, there's a corpse. Edwin Tiong, civilian. Dead. Sure, let's go this way. This is ridiculous. How did it grow this world in a few months? Oh, don't worry. They won't answer. These plants okay. can naturally develop this fast. Kane developed the technology to accelerate plant growth. Oxygen is big business. Oxygen is big business. Let's go over here. Let's go look at this corpse. Anything else in here that's stupid and bullshit? No? Okay, moving on. Oh, a metal plaque. Oh, 
Oh, a vaporizer pad. What is this? Report. The vaporizer, the perfected MK V model of the Kane Corporation Transit. There's so much fucking reading in this fucking game, dude. I swear to God. Using advanced and unique molecularization technology, the vaporizer has the ability to shift the target substance between gas, liquid, and solid states without any of the structural breakdown seen in objects shifted between states on regular basis. Okay, the MK model, yada yada yada. It's been very level 4 because specific H2 <laughs> Okay, what's over here? Finally, we have more room for the the, 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 the Linesia's Harvester working on so hard, yada yada, yada, yada. Project Kitchen Knife and see what it is, the oxygen. Jesus Christ. Where it is quite unlike anything in the initial project projections, yada yada yada. Last year became worse against secret ruling. Oh shit. Like I'm. I'm not, I'm no longer scared anymore. Okay, what the fuck was that? I am like no longer scared of this game. I'm surrounded by incompetence. <laughs> am I surrounded by incompetence? Gonna take Project Kitchen Knife on myself for this stupid dialogue. Dude, for real, man. <laughs> Uh, it's supposed to have a thing for my current position. It was his. Uh, regarding the project, some of the bug eggs failed to hatch properly. Uh, I suspect that this is why the queen was more aggressive than usual. There are more than enough drones to continue the collection of work. Uh, their unique chemical properties. I work and appreciate most of the da The insects are restless, they rumble at their apiaries. More than usual, armed guards all over the place. I stopped by one of the other day and the reason going, okay. Well, after explaining the hand of the I recall complaining about the Yo! Yo, V! V is hosting! Welcome, V. Thank you for the host, V. How are you, dude? We are in the middle of fucking reading another, like, the 20th fucking PDA of this fucking playthrough. Thank you for the host, V. Jesus Christ. I haven't fucking... I haven't played at all. I haven't played at all. I've been reading. It's so... <laughs> But the lore, dude, fuck the lore. We already know what it is. Fungus is growing. It's affecting all the clones, and the clones are attacking people. We already fucking know. Yeah, you've been watching cutscenes? Well, at least you got something to look at. I've been reading fucking books. I might as well have read God Emperor Dune while I was at this, and that way everybody would be more entertained. Jesus. By the way, how were the cutscenes? Were they good? I'll just probably watch the VOD. <laughs> uh, I was, uh, this is... Dude, V, no lie. Me and Kraft have been at this for like two hours trying to figure out what the fuck to do with this one puzzle and it was annoying. They're still good. <laughs> now, what? What's... Wait, who's there? Who's here? Who's here, huh? I asked one of Dr. Milan's assistants that if that fungal substance discovered growing in the bowels of the ship had anything to do with us. I lied, of course, but yada yada yada. Confidential. As observed in the monkey memes for testing, the monkey shrieked and thrashed in the rage for the first few days after it was exposed, and when it became quiet, observant, and uncanny. Okay, it's certainly aggressive, but then again, which virus aren't? Okay. No, 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 we just lost control of the deck. They're still good. I just wanted a 60 FPS remastered to MGS4. That's all I want. 
it might happen if if Konami if Konami's like greedy enough, they might do it. Let's see. But instead, we get Mario Golf, baby. Woo! <laughs> uh... Wait, what? Oh, this is from Akiza? Okay, let's see her fucking family history since I'm already invested in here. I nearly refused entry. I was nearly refused entry because of my family's background. My school peers regarded my great great uncle was unbearable. What did your uncle do, though? What did your great great uncle do? Like, why would you? What? What? What does that even matter? Why does that even matter? Why would you be denied medical? Why would you be denied going to medical school because of what your great great uncle did? What fucking what? I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. This is so fucking nonsense, dude. Being vague as shit. I hear bees. You guys want to see a funny death right now? You guys want to see a funny death? Let's go. Oh damn, he actually got swarmed. You got the family curse so this whole line can't go to school. Not the bees! I thought I was gonna get an achievement for that, but I guess not. Oxygen levels increasing. He didn't read up on his beat facts, true. Should be more careful, damn, dude. <laughs> he can't just buzz around like that. <laughs> okay, everybody, give me your B jokes, please, because I'm actually honestly fucking annoyed. Just give me more B jokes, please. Honey, you keep getting him killed. <laughs> do I need to put this here? It doesn't work like that. Okay, well, let's just do that. Uh, activate the vapor. Chamber right compromised. Chamber is not yet right. I don't think that'll work. Make sure you comb the whole room. That was a joke. That was a pun, but like you're you're honestly right. If you if you ever look at my vods, V, you're gonna you're gonna understand what I mean. Absolutely fucking stupid. That was some fucking Sierra bullshit. Like you say that as a joke, but like I legit have to do that. I don't know what I was thinking there. This isn't gonna work. Wait, shut the fuck up, John. I swear to God. I 
I mean, that's my experience with every point and click. I like puzzles, but there has to be something going on. Yeah, true. Oxygen levels increasing. All this talking under his breath, you swear he was a mumblebee. Oh my god, dude, that was fucking reaching, but that was actually pretty funny. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that was actually funny. Let's go touch this queen real quick. How would you, how would you know, how would you, don't pull your dick in that, don't put your dick in that, don't worry. How would you know to do that, though? Oh. I got ate by the thing. Do you need a USB for that terminal? Shut up. Okay. <laughs> that one was actually pretty good, too. How would you know you needed to do that? If that makes no sense. What? 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 I can't see it working like that. What? I don't think this will fit. That's just crazy. Milking Hello. suction cup, yeah. It's a milking suction cup. I don't know what I was thinking there. I think that would break. No, they still attack me even when I have the fucking queen hiding me. Okay, whatever. What is this clip? 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 Let me close this fucking walkthrough because I have to cheat. Be more careful. How would you know to do that though? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. I'm playing like a drone. Oh my god. That I can't tell if you're joking or insulting me. That kind of hurt on two levels. That's just crazy. I can try to make it fit, but it may break. Oh my god. Duh. These puzzles are too obtuse. Vaporizer chamber compromised. Chamber is not airtight. I don't know what I was thinking there. I don't think this will fit. You're you're back you're back to be be puns. I don't think that'll work. Another locked door. 
Rude is truly a wannabe in this game. Drone equals male honeybee. I know, I know what a drone is. That's why I said I can't tell if you're joking or you're insulting me because I know what a drone is. But it also means like I'm playing like a boar. But I've explained it and now it's ruined, yeah. I know what you meant. I knew what you meant, V. <laughs> Ah, uh, the fuck, dude? Come on, man. Come on, man. What the hell? What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to stab? Am I supposed to stab the fucking queen right on her fucking head with her own thing? No, no, that won't work. I don't think that'll work. This isn't gonna work. This is what I mean. This is what I mean. This is what I mean, dude. This is this is this is this is exactly what I fucking mean. Nah, insults would be hitting below the belt. Okay. Would you say V's puns are really? St would you say V's puns really stung rude? Oh my god. You know what? You guys are actually keeping me more entertained than this fucking game. I swear. I don't know what I was thinking. Man. How would you know that you would stab the fucking Amber with the stupid I with can't the see with the like that? He just flex sealed that glass. Yup, he uh, he really did. He really fucking did. Positive rude? Oh my god. Do I need more than one? Do I need more than one? Is that what happened? Did I waste time? Look out. <laughs> Night trip! Look out behind you! When you respawn, does that make you a zombie? I trap thing slaps it does How many how many do we need do we need three of these so they can fucking go away activate the vaporizer <laughs> It do be slapping. Okay, we can only carry one of the items. Waste of time. Let's just fucking go. I don't know what I was thinking there. No! Don't go in the fucking swarm, you dumb clod, dude. I swear to God. You have an easier time if you had a bazooka. Oh my God. Ah! Ah! What happened? What happened? They disappeared! What the frick, dude? Oh.
Gun's little worker brain can't figure out this one out. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> High five, you died again. Be yourself. <laughs> Give me that fucking queen titty milk, dude. It's time to fucking rub it all over myself because that fucking thing doesn't work. I don't think that'll work. Hmm. Nope. Okay. You can't show. You can't shove it in the oxygen thing in the side of. The, uh, um, I could try. I could try. Maybe I didn't try that. So let me try it right now. Ah, uh, you know what? Maybe that's what I have to do. Maybe that's what I have to do. I'm not going to be upset that that's the answer because I didn't try it. Very descriptive, I know. Mm. No, it doesn't let me. I don't think that'll work. Why would it not? These plan is fucking solid as shit. Why wouldn't it work? I think that'll just break it. No. Crazy. Why is that crazy? <laughs> There's not a way to turn the oxygen on. I, I, I turned it on though. Like I had to it I turned it on already. I can't turn it off. This isn't gonna work. Thank you, Craft. Thank you, Craft. Because that makes more sense? Yeah, true. Apparently, apparently, instead of the pheromones scaring away or making the bees docile, it makes them more aggressive. Why would they attack their own fucking queen? Why would it make them more why would it make them more aggressive to attack the queen? They became horny bees? I don't fucking know, dude. One. Oxygen levels increasing to dangerous levels. Oh boy, too much oxygen, everybody. Watch out. Oxygen levels pose the fire hazard. C sec has been notified. 
Made sense. Queen Slay. It's beautiful. The oxygen garden's my favorite part of any ship. Green, full, natural. Where am I? Emergency flare. Fucking bitch, why does she get to me? Make milk while we don't kill her. Oh shit, we killed our queen. Now he did. <laughs> I don't. I don't understand it. I don't. I don't. I don't fucking. I don't fucking get it. I don't fucking get why. Oh look, a corpse. Anything else over here before we go? I gotta like make sure that it's a catastrophe. Uh, or a catastrophe. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Let's go look at this corpse. Okay. Oh, look! This thing is still alive. Where am I? Oh, I'm right here. There needs to be a better way to highlight the character because I cannot see where the fuck I am. And then you, like, see this weird figure like oh that's me that's not a fucking scary thing stagnant water collection pool <laughs> corpses corpses thick vine dude that fucking vine be thick dude oh god Behave yourself, please. Oh, god damn it. I can get you out. I can cut you free. Eleanor got some titties, though. <laughs> You, are you serious right now, John? Don't be fucking Mr. High and Mighty right now. I can't murder people. What the fuck? She wants to die. It's assisted suicide at this point. She's a fucking living fungus. Just fucking kill her. Let's let's learn the little bit background of Eleanor Way because now it got kind of interesting again. Lord is gracious and merciful, slow to anger and great in love and kindness. Oh my God, she's a fucking Jesus freak. Okay, the Lord is good to all. <laughs> I simply wish his kindness had extended to Chelsea. The galley chef told me that a few of the other crew members are uncomfortable with having an ARG patient on staff. I asked if her work was in any way below standard, at which point he grew uncomfortable and admitted exactly as I thought. No, she was a superb worker, but his team were uncomfortable with her anyways. Being a genetics and a Christian may appear contradictory to most, but that is their burden and not mine. I believe in grace and mercy. It wasn't Chelsea's fault she was born an ARG baby, whatever that means. Oh, would you shut the fuck up? <laughs> James, my ex-husband, blamed me. James wanted her terminated and I refused. He packed up and left. That suits me. I'd rather be without an unloving husband and, and father than without my beautiful child. And she, and she is. She's beautiful. A gift from God. And for a ship full of the most supposedly forward-thinking people in the galaxy, her aversion, their aversion to her condition repulses me. I don't. What's ARG? I don't understand what that is. What condition is that? Tolerance and patience are virtues greatly praised by the Lord. But aboard the Groom Lake, I find many stories of both 
these virtues sorely tested. I discovered through one of the subordinates that a new shipment arrived on board a few days ago, destined for Project Seed. My disapproval of the dangers of Seed are no are no secret, considering the size of the shipment and the clear attempt to cut me out of the loop regarding the delivery. I suspect some of my colleagues are trying to mask the precise nature of what it is that has arrived. If it is as I suspect, there will be no, and I mean no, lengths I will go to in order to depose Dr. Milan. Augmented reality game. Seed. Final Fantasy VII wants to be t wants her terms back. <laughs> oh. Augmented reality game. K Corporation is. <laughs> Sorry, eight. Okay. K Corporation is a company for the promotion of sciences, not the sinister schemes and unprincipled ambitions of individuals. I have a moral issue. I have moral issues with Kane and their weapons research. It tests my faith, but Kane's medical breakthroughs have changed the world and my world too. It's because of Kane's created research that Chelsea is even alive. This is why I do what I do. I work in genetics to find cures to my dear for my dearest Chelsea and others like her, not for money. It's my job to put things right for her. I read that as it's my job to put things in her. <laughs> no. I had lunch with Dr. Gray this afternoon. He is an odious little man and utterly misanthrop mis misanthropic. But if you need somebody to talk to about Project Seed. There are a few people who given up information more easily. His ego easily outweighs his sense of confidentiality. The forbidden nectar. No! <laughs> project leaders and project members are not allowed to discuss details of individual projects, but he can't resist. He can't resist himself. Nonetheless, he revealed disturbing details. I'm aware of our sample origins. We need human genetic material in order to develop cures for human beings. It's a hard truth, but there's paperwork, permission forms, and contracts that create the supply that shipment has none of those things. They're children. Oh, God, and, and all great mercy, how could you let Mil Milan, that unholy monster, do this? It's taken months, but finally I found a young cargo worker named Danica Boxer. She was d referred to me by Dr. Tenshu, such a sweet girl. It seems that cargo was a combination of adults and children, all whom were acquired through illegally channeled, illegal channels for use of genetic research. I did not agree to this. I'll leave this place to take Chelsea with me before I spend one minute, one minute more working for these companies that endorse the use of children in research. There's not enough words to describe the soulless creatures that did this. Revenge? I do not believe in revenge. Beloved, never avenge yourself. But leave it to the wrath of God, for it is written, Vengeance is mine. I will repay, says the Lord. Where is she? The creatures are attacking in full force. The screams are over the radio. They're dying. They're all dying. I hear the scuttle through the vents. I see the blood they spill and spray over the walls. Chelsea, Chelsea, oh God, please bring her to me. I'm trapped in hydroponics. Please let my, let my little girl find me. I can see Chelsea inches from me, lifeless. I, can, I'm, I contemplated taking my own life as she did if she, as she died just before my eyes are you getting mario golf oh no i'm you're talking to me never mind. i'm not getting mario golf when those creatures attacked the crew sealed off parts of the ship and she was and i was left trapped in hydroponics that fungus got me and now it's inside profaning my body its nerves wrapped around my cerebral cortex i can feel it move i try to move my arms but it won't let me it's making me watch the fungus consume my baby girl i must not i must watch and pray for the end to come so when it does not depend on the man who wills or the man who runs but on god who has mercy Oh my god, I'm done reading this shit. I know you are, Rude, you big party pooper. <laughs> Maybe you should stream it to help me decide.
this. But you need to help me first. I don't need you to leave. I need you to crack this flare. The oxygen will ignite. Then you will die. Uh, yes, literally die in one of the most horrible level. ways possible. For real. The fire systems just went haywire over here, John. What did you do? I cleared the vines. With a flamethrower. Something like that. Fire in oxygen gardens. One, three, five, six, nine. Fire in Oxygen Gardens 2, 7, 8. Fire Suppression System activated. Warning. Fire Suppression System compromised. Ugh. Warning. Shit! Oxygen reduction has been compromised. Are the bombs still intact? Oh. Oh, God, please don't say burn them out. Uh, is this supposed to be? This is this, is this supposed to be funny? Was that supposed to be funny? Cause a chain reaction, John. You're all going up. We have a time limit now. How is it most? Get my daughter right now. Crispy burnt vines. Better to die a pog. Goodbye. Better to die a pog than to than die a scrub. Where is she to? Where is Rebecca? She's in the containment area at the other end of Seed. Looks like this place is being expanded. Seed was always expanding. That place scares me. Thanks. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Mega lockdown. Okay. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna fuck call it here. To be honest. To be very honest, I think I am gonna call it here. I am like that. That shit. No. <laughs> that shit was a big no. I'm already fucking over it today. I'm over it today. <laughs> Fuck me, dude. Are you com are you fucking kidding me right now?
Jesus Christ. Uh, anyways, anyways, I'll play more of this tomorrow. But today was like honestly one of the worst sessions of this fucking playthrough. That was honestly like really fucking bad. But yeah. Uh, anyways, before I go, I want to let everybody know that this stream is going to be available as a VOD once I hit the stop button. So you can check it out here on twitch.tv slash Rubirdo immediately, or you can check it out on youtube.com slash Rubirdo TV, where I will upload it tomorrow. I will upload it tomorrow. And, uh, yeah. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. What the frick, dude? Wait a minute. Hold up. The wait. The, look who's back. Look who's back. Who the heck? Who the heck? Look who's back, everybody. Oh my God! It's Redo. We're gonna raid Redo. I haven't seen Redo in a while. Redo's playing Minecraft right now. Thank you for the plugs, Craft. We're gonna raid Redo, dude. Redo is back. Redo is back, everybody. Look at him. Look at him go. Redo. What? Why not? We're going to be raiding Redo. If his freaking stream isn't lagging right now. Yeah, dude, Redo is back. He ain't in your list. He, I, I'm seeing him right now. He just popped up for me. What the heck? Okay, everybody. Uh, we're gonna raid Redo. Give give Redo a, a, a welcome back, a warm welcome back, because it's been a long time. Home little homies play freaking Minecraft. Fucking enjoy Minecraft more. Than this. But anyways, everybody, I will be back tomorrow. I will be back tomorrow. I will play this tomorrow. Uh, hopefully, I will beat it before uh, Saturday. Before uh, hopefully, I will beat it on Friday, or at least you know on at least try to beat it on Friday. Because Saturday, I'm not gonna be here. But yeah, uh, we're gonna raid. We're going to raid Redo. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. As always, take care. Stay safe. Have fun. I appreciate all you little shit. Any <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let's go raid Redo, everybody. Bye-bye.